Oh my. What up, what up? Will here with the Baseball Bat Bros. Today, folks, we're all the way out in Connecticut. We're gonna do a bat demo day. We have three UConn players here. They all have three different bats they're trying out. They have an open bat contract. So their coach lets them kind of use whatever they prefer. So we're gonna let them try out pretty much everything because we have a lot of bats, so let's get it. All right, folks, we are out here at Elliott Ballpark. It's freaking gorgeous. We have a pretty big ballpark, 400 to center, 370, 380 to the gaps. We have a dude that I think will pepper the batter's eye. It's going to be a fun day. Each guy's a unique set of three bats. Let's go. Can I have Yes, please, bro. Medco, the right fielder, the Big East player of the year, departed. And that ball is crushed. Forget about it. It's gone. The Albino Rhino strikes here in stores. Let's go, Willis. Oh, good effort. That's a good swing. One more, one more. That's a good swing. Oh, boy. That one I mean, man. boy. Do you care if I put tar on this? Oh, he hits this one deep to right. Going back and see you later. Home run for the Red Hot David Smith. And the Huskies are on the board. Oh, my God. That's loud. Meyer now against Morton, who got this whole inning started, and he skies one to left. Park is going to watch it. It is over the trees. And UConn is blowing Stanford out. Flies to right here. Back to me. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. My ball. Yeah. Yeah. That's like good as I'm getting it there. Yeah. Uh, Oh my god. Oh my god. Boy. <laughs> Big Marucci guy or what? Swung at my old school. Oh really? Yeah. I like his lighter. Did you barrel that? No, I got jammed. Yeah, I saw it. You got yeah. you got fisted there. Ah boy. Dude, that just Oh that just didn't want to come down. Did you flare? Flared it out? Yeah. Yeah, that shouldn't count. Push up. Get out. 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 Dude, that's big. Good. 
Yeah. What's your current game? Uh, I have the Rawlings highlighter. The glow stick, bro. How'd you find out about this? Uh, one of my teammates is a high school bat. And you haven't broke okay. it? I haven't broke it yet. Things been a tank for you, all right. There we go. I got that. It just didn't feel great, but all right. All right. I got big hopes for you with this bat, dude. Side spin, yes! I know. I'm, I'm curious to hear your answer, man, because you game the select power right now. Are you willing to betray it? Um, honestly, I think I am. So wow. last year I swung the select. Yep. I love it because it's really forgiving on the middle part of the bat. Like even if you get jammed, it's still really forgiving. It doesn't sting your hands that much either, and yep. you know when you hit it right because it makes that certain sound. The one one, and a swing and a drive into left. No doubt about it. But honestly, the Cat X swing feels the same way with the barrel, how like if you get jammed, it still has the same juice. But I like the light feeling of the Cat X where I can feel like I can get to a lot more pitches because it's so light and the taper handle is so nice because it's like almost feels like a wood bat. All right, David, you got these three bats here, man. We have the Cat X composite, the Voodoo One, and the Black Magic. So if you had to pick one, take home with you today, what do you got, my man? I think I do have a clear answer. I think I'm definitely going Voodoo. Ugh. I mean, in terms of like which one I like the best, I think this one's probably the best one's pretty unreal i have to agree man that bat's really good basic answer but yeah she's hot dude <laughs> That's what it is. all right man so you had kind of a unique combo here you had two of the most end loaded bats in the game and then like a balanced composite bat so your current gamer being the quattro 
uh, that the two piece composite from Rawlings, a little bit more balanced. Yeah. Awesome bat. Did you feel like you enjoyed the end load and that, those kind of heavy bats with the goods and the nuke? Or did you feel like it was kind of messing with your swing a little bit? Uh, no, I thought I liked the the, new, uh, the goods a lot better than the nuke. I thought yeah. the nuke was a little little heavier. And I thought I was going to like the Marucci in the earlier rounds, but winner of the day has got to be the goods. Really? Yeah. That honestly really surprised me. I thought you were going to go with the cat composite. The goods just had a better feel, better uh, feel of the ball off the barrel, and uh, just felt better. Are you still going to swing your glow stick? Uh, yeah, I don't think I can get rid of the glow stick. No. So that, until it breaks on me. That's an all-timer, yeah. bro. All right, folks, then for me, I mean, it's going to be a toss up between these two. Boring answer. This just, this was good. One of the better Eastons, honestly. I think this will be a popular bat in college baseball for those Easton contract schools. But I felt like this had the least forgiving barrel of the three. It had a similar swing weight to the select, similar pop to the select. These are very similar. The select just has a better feel, better sound, more forgiving barrel. You can catch it down towards the hands like they were saying. It feels amazing. So it's a toss up between these two for me. This is hotter, more barrel, just noticeably heavier, man. You gotta be kind of a strong guy and you also have to be decently wealthy because this is a fragile bat as of now. We'll see if they kind of fix the durability this year, but I feel like I had a little bit of a hard time controlling the barrel with the goods. I was barreling the ball more consistently with the select power, man. So like, I don't know if I can really give you like a clear answer of which one is objectively better because it's just two different preferences, two different hitters, but I like this better <laughs> than both of those. I think this combines it all. It's a decently forgiving barrel. I think it's even hotter than both of those. As long as durability is gonna hold up on this bat, I would be all over it. All right, folks, so that's all we got here at UConn from Elliott Ballpark. And just a reminder, as always, you can head over to BaseballBatBros.com to check out our constantly updated BB Core rankings. We literally have our 1 through 50 uh, bat rankings along with Bat Bro scales for all of those. Guys, huge shout-out to freaking UConn for inviting us out. Oh, my Lord! Well... Holy change up. Oh, dear. Yeah. Barrel. 